This is hunting, trapping, and other cool stuff with Logan Farley. And today I have the I have three things here to show y'all. And first I'm gonna go with um no nah, first I'm gonna go with this right here. It's a Lee bullet mold. The easy to use bullet mold. Takes the work out of bullet casting. And I ordered a forty five caliber, uh two hundred grand four forty off of eBay. And I got it in the mail a few days a few a few days ago and I opened it up and you know I'm excited to get my stuff and I don't know if you know and I'll look it in though, you know, to make sure that it's a forty five caliber and as you might see here it's I don't know if you can, I don't know if you can see or not, but it's a fifty caliber here and I got it out just to make sure that it is a 50 caliber and not a 45 in the wrong box. And it is indeed a uh, 50 caliber. See, a uh, bullet, bullet and ball mold. Uh, yeah, and I uh, was pretty disappointed that the guy sent me the wrong stuff. But uh, we'll get it. I can send it back and get a uh, 45. I can get it fixed, you know. Um, I will be sending this back when the guy emails me back. I'll be sending it back, you know, and get me the, and he'll send me the uh, 40. I'll send him this, and it'll also be the 45. And whenever I do get it, um, Probably gonna make a video of making some bullets and balls about the Leaddale baking stuff. I don't know when that'll be. Like I said, I'll have to build this back and look where we at. So it'll be a pretty long time. Yeah, it'll be a good while before I do get to uh to do a uh a video on it here. It'll be a it'll be a while. Yeah. Yep, it'll be a while, so, uh, I'll go ahead and go on to the next thing. Next thing, I got this on the mail the same day I got it in the mail. And, right here, I got it in the mail and everything. It comes from, I don't know how to pronounce it, but it comes from Mexico. I don't know how to pronounce the, uh, place it comes from. But anyway, I'll be showing you what's inside. When we open it up, we have cow horns. And it's cow horns, as you can see. Um, two of them. I got two of them. I have two of them, yeah. Two. I got two. You know, cow horns. Yeah, anyway. I got two, and, uh, well, you're probably wondering why I got two cow horns. The reason for that is because. I am, I got my mother loader over here, a uh, 45 caliber, and I don't have a power horn, so I'm going to be, so I'm going to be making these into a powder horn, and making one of them into a powder horn, actually, and I'll go, uh, I'm going to my papa's this weekend, and that's when we're going to uh, make it, and I'll probably, um, make a video of us um, making the powder horn. I, I, actually, I will be making a video of us making these powder horns. Or we'll making one, but I will be making a video of us making the cow horns. And I'm going up there this weekend. Well, tomorrow, I'll be going up there tomorrow evening. And we'll be doing this probably Saturday. Today is Thursday. And I'll be probably posted the video either Sunday evening or Monday evening when I get home from school. So, or if there's no school because there might not be because we got a bunch of snow outside and ice. So, if we don't have school, it'll probably be just like Monday morning. But if we do, it'll be, um, 
it'll be Monday evening. So anyway, I just thought I'd tell y'all that I'd be having another video of making a making a power one out of one of these. Yeah, just thought I'd show y'all that. And um, I have one more thing. I have one more thing to show y'all. What I have next is this. Um, just some like old rope, you know, and just like so it's some uh, rope, and I like the design on it. Kindly, it's like looks like Mountain Man, like like what they would use on the uh, power horn. I don't know if you can uh, see that real good or not. Um, Hold on, let me get a light. Y'all might can see that a little better. Okay, I'm back. Sorry it took so long. I had to hunt up the light. But anyway, I got this here. Um, holy moly, that's bright. But anyway, I got that. I'll shine that right here like that. Sorry for the glare and blur on the bottom of the screen. But anyway, it's a uh, nice little design like thing on it. And, uh, I like it pretty good, so um, what I'm going to do with this here rope is, I have a few of these ropes, I might, oh sorry, I might tie them together, and what I'm going to do is, whenever I get the power horn all finished, I'm going to put a screw, little screw like thing in it, and tie ropes, so it'll go, go around me, you know, and hang there, and this says the rope I'm going to use. For I thought it looked pretty good and everything, you know, I got a pretty good, pretty good roll of it and everything, and, well, I figured I'd just show y'all that, and I do have one more thing, maybe two, to show you. Let me get it real quick. powder horn. Um, this is my dad's powder horn. That's how we're going to be doing it. You know, that little um, what I'm going to be doing is if you can see that right there that's what I'm going to be putting the string through is that and that so it'll uh you know, like, go around me there, like that, and, you know, the rope. Uh, anyway, uh, I'll be doing it like this. And that's what I'm going to be making this for my dad. Just thought I'd show you what it, it might look like, what it's probably going to look like. Yeah, um, I got one thing. It's random. I didn't say it was going to show it or nothing, but I just think it's real cool just to add it in the video. It's, um... A bow here. You'll probably can't see it real well, but it's a bow. My uh, how about give me? And um, it's a uh, name's a death one. Um, uh, I don't know what kind of wood it is, but it was made in. Oh five. My papa will give me. My papa will give it to me in oh nine. And um, I've never killed a deer with it. I don't know if my papa has or not. Um, 
but um, it was just the um, bow, and then Bobo killed a snake when he was at the river fishing one time. He saw a snake, and he uh, killed it, and it was a black snake. He took the skin and put on the, the bow here. That's snake skin. I don't know if you can tell or not, but that's what that is. Uh, really nice bow and everything. And, uh, well, uh, that's about it for this video. I'll be making another video soon. And see y'all next time.